All right, Kim, thank you. We marked World Mental Health Day this month, and tonight we want to shine a light on recovery for addiction and behavioral health issues. Joining us now is Tom Farley, who is a longtime mental health advocate. Thank you so much for being Great here. Great to be here. Yeah, thank you. We're happy to have you. You have a very personal connection to this. I do. Yeah, we all know your brother, beloved comedian Chris Farley, had a very public battle with mental illness and addiction. How did his experience lead you to become an advocate? Oh, wow. Um, well, you know, I, and I say this a lot, is I was very fortunate in when Chris passed away uh, that I realized one thing more than anything else in that was that uh, if I needed to, if I was going to heal or, you know, just get over there, I needed to talk about it. Yeah. And that's what I started doing. I started going into schools and, and talking about it, and it did help. Um, not just in that healing and, 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 and connecting with other families that have lost uh, p people and loved ones as well, but it also helped me in my journey yeah. in recovery uh, as well. It took me a little longer, yeah. but uh, I got there myself and, uh, and now I'm actually, you know, working, you know, in the field just trying to help as many people as possible. Yeah. So, wow, that feels fantastic. And I think it was so important to so many people for you to be able to share your yeah. experience because Chris was so important to so many people and a big part of my is. childhood, yeah. I know. It's yeah. Crazy. It is. So, it is. Yeah. So, you talked about your work. Oh, there's a picture of you guys, by the way. There we are. Love yeah. that. <laughs> yeah. Little old. Aww. Uh, I'm wearing the same jacket. Still I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> Um, so you recently joined the team at recovery.com. What is your role there? Oh my gosh, so I am uh, the um, community outreach director, which is really just getting messaging. You know, th this is a tech company, mm -hmm. although its, it's, it's subject is, is recovery. Mm -hmm. You know, it's a website, which I, and I love that it's a startup here in Madison. Yeah. But these are tech guys, and they're like, well, we don't know how to get in front of people and talk to them. I'm like, <laughs> I, I can help you with that. I can help. <laughs> that I've gotten used to, and so, yeah. uh, it's really get messaging and, and getting a, uh, just kind of getting uh, people aware that, that there's that there's a resource uh, to find the help that they need. Okay, so it's connecting people with the to, resources to uh, uh, recovery. Uh, you know, um, it would be that you know, addiction. You know, um, mm -hmm. uh, mental health, uh, or just you know, after all that, all the treatment recovery as well. So uh, it's it's kind of like a a trip advisor, you mm -hmm. know, car gurus, you know, for for recovery. And started here in Madison, which is incredible. Which is, yeah, it really is. Yeah. So you experienced firsthand the difficulty of having a loved one who is struggling. How important is it for family and friends to get involved to try to help people connect with those resources? Well, not only is the yeah, is it hard to find uh, just the edu you know, just to educate yourself and find the you know the resources. Mm -hmm. um, but then you've got to go through just all the other hurdles like stigma mm -hmm. and shame, and and uh, those are those are hard things to to uh, to to, uh, to to battle with. And so, any way to to uh, to make it um, easier for people, and the the way the site was uh, created was uh, you know people first, patient first. You know, yeah. it's really helping just in understanding what like what they need to get help for themselves. Or a loved one, and uh, and I can't even imagine what it was like for my parents. Yeah. Before the internet, with Chris, when it first yeah. kind of started, they had to do it all, you know, by word of mouth, and and so it's it's gotten be better. H however, you know, the internet is a is a it's a it's a there's just so much out there, and yeah. there's been there's more searches for recovery help now than ever before, and yet there's no resources uh, that are really efficient. Mm -hmm. To do that, so uh, I just I'm, I'm thrilled that uh, that we have one and, and, and it's homegrown. Right here, yeah. yeah. Well, such important work. We so appreciate you sharing your story and all all the advocacy yeah. that you're doing. It means a lot to so many people. Yes. So thank it, you. Uh, and, we, and and again, and I'm I'm healing too. I'm still yeah. doing that, and it does feel fantastic to uh, to connect yeah. and help people, and and myself. And help you too. Well, yeah. Tom, thank you so much for thank being you. here today and for sharing. You bet.